Wow, what a big weekend for our San Diego Gulls. Okay, we got Bakersfield tonight, and then we got the teddy bear toss tomorrow. A big winter wonderland extravaganza. Matt, there's going to be a lot happening. President of Business Operations here, along with our, our Gulls squad here. What an exciting weekend for you guys. You guys feeling it? You going to bring it? We are feeling it, and thank you so much, Eric, for having us on. It's yeah, great to be here. For sure. Uh, yes, we got a big weekend of Gulls hockey. It starts tonight. We have $2 Bud Lights, which Oh, yeah, for sure. Tonight. It's a big hit. And our guys will be wearing their third jerseys, which we debuted the day, uh, day after Thanksgiving. The these colors. Yes, they're yes. beautiful. But tomorrow night, we are we're bringing it all out tomorrow <laughs> night. Tomorrow night, come early. Okay. We've got a winter wonderland out in the parking lot where we're going to have a life-size snow globe that you can go in and interact. It's going to be snowing in San Diego, people. Santa's going to be there. Santa Gulliver. Santa Gulliver, Gulliver. Yep. Yeah. Okay. And then as you walk in, we're going to give one of these beautiful toques to every single fan that comes in. The first 8,000 that come in will get this. It's really great. It's quality. You can show your uh, pride on the slope. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> and then once you get in, we have a very special thing called the teddy bear toss. And this isn't just fun. I love that you guys do this. This this has a deeper meaning to it and it goes a long way. It really does. So this is something where we're uh, connecting with our local children's hospitals yeah. and our local uh, charities where we're inviting all of our fans to bring a wrapped teddy bear, put it in a plastic bag. Sure. And then as soon as we score our first goal, which will probably be early because the goals are hot. No, that's here, right. Yes. You're going to then throw your bear onto the ice okay. after our first goal. Then we're going to have the players help us gather all the bears mm -hmm. up. All the bears will then be donated to Ronald McDonald House, a couple other oh, local that's great. charities. Wow. There's a lot of kids in need this time of year. Yeah. So this is a fun way for our fans to get invited or get involved and then also uh, take care of a charity. That'll brighten their days. Yeah. Do you, uh, the Gulls girls, you guys going to have your shovels ready? Because I believe so many bears actually There's come on. So many bears. It's <laughs> such a great sight to see. You don't want to miss it. We'll shovel it up, collect all the bears. It's so much fun. Awesome. Hey, Gulliver, what do you think? Does this, uh, this guy look uh, like someone that you might know a little bit? Yeah, a little resemblance there. Uh, Matt, let's talk about the season a little bit. Uh, we're about 500 right now. Yep. Uh, nine wins, ten losses. We're a little lower on the division than we'd like to be, but we're only about a third away through the season, and we've got some uh, good momentum here, right? We really do, and, and I like to always put a positive spin on this. Yes. We have played really well at home. All of our fans come out and support awesome. the team. And what we've done is we've gotten points in the last uh, five out of our last six home games. Okay. We've gotten points. So we anticipate some points tonight and tomorrow night. Uh, let's talk about uh, the new captain. Yeah. I mean, this is exciting. This is a guy who knows how to play hockey. Yeah, so Pattern's our new captain. He was just uh, announced last week. Uh, this is a veteran of the uh, NHL and AHL. He's played almost 300 games in the, a in the NHL. So this is a guy who knows his way around the rink, and he knows how to lead a young team, which is what we have. We've got great draft picks that are going to be on their way to Anaheim in the coming years, but right now we need some stability with a veteran guy like Pattern. You guys get these guys ready for the NHL. You get them ready for the real deal, and in some cases you get them ready for ESPN highlights like we saw the other day with Zegras and the lacrosse style pass over the net and if you're confused about what I'm talking about just go to my social media pages I posted it there that was ridiculous as a guy who was a former Gulls player you see that in the NHL you got to feel like that's something special so, right Eric you've played hockey for a long time yeah. I've been around it my whole life I've never seen a goal anything close to that it was unbelievable <laughs> was awesome. a chance. Trevor Zegas behind the net tipped out of the air out front 50 million views oh. on social media. 50 million views. Oh, man. I think hockey's alive in San Diego and I California. think so. Yeah, wow. Uh, and again, he played for the Gulls for a short while, brought up to, to the mothership, if you will. Uh, and the Ducks playing well, too. Yeah, Ducks right? are playing really well. Yeah. yeah. They've been fun to watch. If you get a chance, tune in to go see the Ducks. They are fun to watch right now. Uh, let's talk real quick about the COVID protocols. Let's remind everyone, because everyone right now, I think they're sold, okay? They, they want this cap. They know that there's going to be a lot going on. They know it's some good matchups. We've got uh, Bakersfield to Tonight. We've got the Barracuda tomorrow night. They're going to get these freebies. They're going to see everything out there. But we got to keep in mind there's some protocols that have changed, right? Absolutely. As always, we're following the California state mandate. So what we're doing is we're requiring everyone to either have a negative test or be fully vaccinated before they come in. Once they come in, we're asking that everyone wears a mask the entirety of the game. And that's really just to make sure that we're in line with what California is asking us to do. Winter Wonderland, this is such an exciting time of year, right? I mean, how, how, how fun is this for you guys to be a part of, you know, here in San Diego? Well, well, well hockey's a winter sport, right? So right. for me, Christmas and the holidays is synonymous with hockey. Yeah. So I always uh, love seeing the families come out, especially when there's a little break from school. For sure. We have a bunch of games uh, this weekend, and we got a couple next week as well. So it's really fun to have everyone come in and engage in our sport and have some fun and see Santa Gulliver. I mean, come on. Absolutely. And, you know, you guys have, have fun 
off the ring too and really involved in the community and we, we had the, the book drive the other day we've a couple times mentioned you guys out in the community because you guys have always said you are San Diego's team you, and it's not just on the ice it's off the ice too you're proud of the efforts I'm really proud and uh, we, we do a lot with Rady Children's Hospital right. we do a lot with the local school system and it's really important to our owners and really our whole front office staff to make sure that when we're in San Diego it's not just to play hockey yeah. it's to give back to make sure the schools are thriving the hospitals are thriving so that's uh, that's part of who we are absolutely and you know I remember these hats growing up in Minnesota you needed these to keep the ears warm so your hair wasn't wet after the hockey game otherwise it would freeze um, so yeah these are these are a good get whether you're going to be in town and it's a little chilly because in San Diego 50 degrees is chilly let's be honest yeah. or maybe you're heading up to the mountains yeah. and this will keep your uh, your head warm uh, so don't forget about the teddy bear toss Gulliver let's see if you can toss yourself well, I'm gonna go down here see how far you can toss yourself <laughs> there you go now imagine what hundreds of these uh, I'm gonna say thousands, thousands of these thousands. on the ice gonna yeah. keep the goals girls very busy with yeah. their shovels of course um, where can people learn more about all the uh, the tickets the game information and then all the protocols yep. uh, tickets are still on sale for tonight so just go to San Diego goals.com they do have a list of the protocols that are required for tonight and tomorrow night okay plus the giveaway ah yes winter wonderland Woo! stuff going on this weekend. Good time of year, guys. Thanks so much for coming on. As always, Matt, appreciate it, buddy. Thank you. Hey, and if uh, just a little trick net as I send it back into you, when things warm up a little bit, uh -huh. you can just pop these puppies up like this and just walk around like that. Okay. You can just hear a little bit better That's when you're good. walking around like that. Like that? <laughs> Look at that. I mean, yeah. very elf-like. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> very festive. That way you can hear that plane that just flew by overhead. That's right. we got to get the gulls banner on that plane. <laughs> yeah. That was good. I can't believe Eric just said that. Your hair used to freeze when Yes, you absolutely. Off. Yeah, that's why you got to put this on and even tie it if you need to down here. Oh, man. It doesn't look okay. that cool, but what do you think? <laughs> hey, you can pull it off. <laughs> Gulliver's like, nah. -uh. <laughs> no, no, no. All right. Thanks, you guys. That looks like a good time. I'll see you back in there.